Hi, my name is Anthony with Nelson World Nigeria. I'm an instructor on the both the American Heart Association and the American Safety and Health Institute. Today, I would like to show you how you can download your BLS ACLS files or First Aid CPR AED ebooks under the AHA platform. Um, first, you could op you would open up your email that you received from your training center. I'm going to be using this as an example. There are two unique things that you would see. First is going to be your serial code, which is this for your ebook. I'm going to be using this under the basic life support. And the second thing you're going to see is the hyperlink that you would use to redeem your access code to download your ebook. So there's already a description in here of how you could redeem your ebooks, but let's just take you through it step by step. So I'm going to copy this out. Remember, this is going to be a hyperlink if it was in your mail. But for now, since I'm using my notepad, it's not going to be hyperlinked. So I'll copy this and open Now you could either use your Google Chrome or Explorer. I decided to use Explorer for this. Okay, so we've gotten to the AHA website, ebooks.hacks.org. Now, there are two things that you have to do, first of all. Before you redeem your code where you are going to put in your this is the point you're going to put in your code where it says enter access code but don't do that yet if you have an account under the aha platform then you could just log in if you don't have an account then you need to again click the login button and create an account so let's click the login button and see what comes up Now you sign in if you have an account, so that are your username or email and your password and you sign in. But if you don't have an account, then you are a new user, you create an account. Now under this option, if you've already been using the eCards for your BLS ACLS pals or first aid CPR AD, then You've already had an account with this and you're using sign in details and your password. But if you are just moving to this option for the first time, then automatically you're a new user, so you need to create an account. So these are the details that you need to fill in country of residence, first name, last name, email, confirm email. If you need to, you could put in a profile image then your phone number changes to nigeria obviously password re-enter password i've read the terms of use and privacy policy you can go through this before you click on this and continue so once again do what uh, full fill in all details as needed Put in Nigeria, then your name, your details. Switch this also. And put in your phone number as needed. It was 234 and put in all your details. So let's go back to uh, the main page, assuming you've already created an account. So once again, we come up here. And when you open the account, this automatically go back to the home page. Once you come back here, since you are already um, logged in, you are going to be asked to 
uh, that redeem your access code. So come back here, copy your access code. Go back to your page and paste. Now, before you do this, you need to download the AHA ebook reader app. Now, once you download this, this helps you to have your ebooks where you can read it offline or while online. It's very important because even if you don't have data or you don't have internet, you can always read your manuals. Now, once you've done that and you've clicked on the ask. So once you put in the code, this appears on your shelf. So you see this VLS course digital video, highlights of 2020, your manual should appear here. Now, when you've done this, then you can launch your AHA ebook app. And this is mine. Now, what you should always do is you need to once more log in to your ebook app so that you'll be able to sync this with your login on the website using the same password and username that you used in the previous one. So get your ebook. And like this, you could just download it into your ebook app and it's in your shelf. So there you go. All your books are on your shelves. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask. Thank you very much and have a good day.